Uh, so it's it's big business, and uh, and there's a lot of money to be made in that industry. The industry is marijuana, and Wisconsin isn't making any money in it. A new poll suggests it's time to change that. That is our big story at five. Premature buzz. The latest Marquette University Law School poll shows for the first time a majority of Republicans favor legalizing marijuana sales in Wisconsin. But there is a big difference in what polls say and politicians do. So where does the push for legal weed in Wisconsin stand tonight? Our Jason Calvi live with more on the changing attitudes. Jason. Hey, Mary. Yeah, the legislative year is almost over, and these marijuana bills that have been introduced in Madison haven't even had a hearing yet, so it's very likely they will not become law this year. There is a bipartisan proposal to allow medical marijuana. Democrats want to go farther. They want to see recreational marijuana. Should Wisconsin legalize sales of marijuana? I don't necessarily see why we wouldn't. Uh, all the states around us are. Um, anyone who's going to is going to get access to it. Wisconsin's neighboring states, Michigan and Illinois, allow recreational sales. The latest Marquette poll asked Wisconsinites if marijuana should be allowed. They've been asking this question for almost 10 years. Now the number backing it is at its highest. 61% of Wisconsinites polled say yes, while 31% say no. And now 51% of Republicans say pot should be allowed. So we've seen across the board increases. This is true in national polling as well. But I do think the, the shift among Republicans is interesting as the party that has been most staunchly opposed to um, enacting legislation on marijuana legalization. Support for marijuana in Wisconsin was lowest in 2014 when Colorado stores first began selling weed. Today we met a Colorado man in Milwaukee. It comes with certain social ills, but it also comes with a lot of tax revenue. Colorado took in $423 million in tax revenue from pot last year. While Wisconsin-based group that urges kids to say no, Your Choice Prevention Education says legalizing it could lead more kids to experiment. They're worried, citing studies that link marijuana use to increased risks for psychiatric disorders, depression, and anxiety. Now, the governor tried to legalize pot in his budget. Republicans had rejected that proposal last year. Now, the Speaker of the House, Robin Voss, has supported medical marijuana, and the Senate Majority Leader says he is opposed to this. He says it's really a federal issue, not for the states to decide. We're live at Marquette. Jason Calvi, Fox 6 News. It's an issue that will continue to be debated. All right, Jason, thank you.